powerful condenser ever created. Impressive, isn't it? Nathan! Oh. It's good to see you. I was so afraid something happened to you. You've lost weight. You look exhausted. But at least you're alive. Let's go into my office. Please, have a seat. How do you feel? <laughs> um, I've been better. That hit on the head did not help. No, I'm sorry. I told them not to hurt you. I just didn't want to give you a chance to use Aiden. What happened to my mother, Nathan? Nora was unstable. They were afraid she was a danger to herself and her baby. My mother would never hurt me. They couldn't take that chance. Look, I was a researcher at the DPA, Jody. I didn't discover until much later what happened. Where's Cole? He's at home. He's fine. I know he was trying to help you. Don't worry, there won't be any consequences for last night. Why all the lies, Nathan? Those people pretending to be my parents. The DPA thought you needed a stable emotional environment. A home, loving parents, some semblance of a normal life. Whatever would help us study you in the right conditions. Study me? Study me? What was I to you, Nathan? A little... Lab rat? I was just a girl, for fuck's sakes. I was just a little girl. Oh, you were the link. The link between our world and the infra world. You were everything we ever dreamed of. So now what? You're just gonna hand me back to the CIA? Is that the plan, Nathan? They brought you here because they have something for you to do, and they'd be very grateful if you do it. You're asking me to help the people who wanted to kill me? Is that what you're asking me, Nathan? Listen, Jody. Why should I listen to you? You work for them, and you lied to me about my mother and my parents, and for what? The money, or the power, or the fame? Oh, stop that, Jody. You know that's not true. I know nothing anymore. We know another country has discovered the infra-world. They think it's something to be controlled or manipulated. They have no idea what they're dealing with. If entities enter our world, do you know what that would mean, Jody? What has all this got to do with me? Because you know the infra-world better than anyone. It's the CIA's job. And I'm done with that. They want to offer you a deal. You do this for them. And they let you out, you're free. Jody, do you know what would happen if a passage is open? It'll be the apocalypse. You have the power to stop this. I'm so tired. Can we go now? Oh, jeez. Is that what time it is? <laughs> I'm sorry. I was concentrating on my work. I know you've had a long day. Hey, this morning I bought you a book. What do you say we get you tucked in and I read to you? Yes, please. <laughs> I must have left it in the other room. Why don't you go in there and get it? I'll finish up here and then we can go, okay? Sure, I'm on it. <laughs>
So, where did he leave that book? Stop it, Aiden. It's not funny. You found it. Now we can get down to the serious business of bedtime stories. <sighs> Jody. Jody, you okay? You look pale. She looks dead tired is how she looks. Come on, Nathan, let's get her off to bed. Yes. Yes, hold on. Nathan, it's for you. Nathan Dawkins. Nathan? Nathan, what's up? My wife. Order. They were coming back from my mother's. Truck. Drunk driver. Wrong side of the road. They're dead. Um. Jody, let's get you off to bed. And stay right here. I'll be right back. Come on, Jody. According to our intel, the Republic of Kazakhstan has discovered the existence of the Infoworld. Found a rift, conducting experiments from a secret base located in the province of Hailaojiang. We don't know what stage they are in their experiments, but we've detected important fluctuations within the Infoworld. That means they've found a way to interact with the other side. Now your mission is to destroy this condenser and any other advanced technology you find. Even if we manage to destroy the condenser, the rift will still be there. Now, building a condenser is a costly and time-consuming business. But this operation will gain time to better understand the infant world and to make sure that no one will try to use it against us. I assume the site will be heavily guarded? Well, you should expect considerable military resistance. Team will. Team? Show them in, Marla. Hey, baby. Good to see you, girl. Clayton's team goes with you, a small, agile commando unit able to avoid detection. The mission begins in two days. Good luck. Be careful, Jody. No one knows what you're going to find on the other side. Don't worry. 
I don't think I'm ready to join the Infra world yet. Good. Because I don't want to lose you. Good to see you. For the mission's sake, I'll try and forget what a fucking bastard you are. Jody, I... Is... You know what? Don't even try. I grew tired of all this. If you refuse to cooperate, I will have no choice but to kill you. Of course, I will kill you regardless. But it could have been fast and painless. Instead, it will be a very, very slow and agonizing death. So, I ask you one last time. Who do you work for? Where are you? 